Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is Monday Must Have and it is on my favorite hard candy products. So hard candy is a line that is sold at Walmart. Um, they are really reasonably priced, I mean compared to Physicians Formula or Flower Cosmetics. So there's one product that I don't have here but it is a really good product. I'm just gonna get that out of the way. It's the Glamouflage Full Coverage Concealer. It is extremely full coverage, and if you said it correctly, it's beautiful. Um, it is a little greasy, so if you use too much, and if you don't set it properly, then it will crease and it will travel, but that is a really good product, but I don't have it because I need to repurchase it. So I'm gonna start off with lip products. So honestly, out of all these products, I think that, um, Hard Candy does the best job on lip products. So right here, I have their Glossaholic Lip Gloss, and this is in Creamsicle. I love the giant tube. I love, look at that giant doe foot. It's beautiful. But let's go ahead and really, really pretty, really, really nice, glossy. It's a very um, peachy nude, but it's so pretty. Another one of their great products is the All Glossed Up Hydrating Lip Stain. I like these ones that are like in a big chubby pencil, and this one really is just so pretty. I love that it's kind of like a rose gold, um, just so pretty. And then this one is a little different. It is their Starfish, um, it is kind of like a lip balm, but it's got a little bit of a tint and it's very hydrating. It's just so nice. I absolutely love it, plus it smells a little bit like vanilla. And finally, the last lip product that I do have to show you, and it's their Hard Candy Lip Tattoo Lip Stain and Breath Freshening Lip Gloss. And this is in Poppy. I do give it a little bit of a shake. And then, so the stain is like a thinner formula, which is nice. And then, but it's so pretty. And then, you know, after it dries, you can kind of build it up a little bit if you want it a little bit darker. And then this, gloss is a little bit of a thicker gloss, which is nice. It's very minty. It's just a nice thick gloss. I do like the compact um, design. Just throw this in your bag or pocket. So the next thing we're going to go for are shadows. So I got two little shadow palettes and some like cream stick shadows. So these um, foiled again metallic shadow sticks, this silver one is in Glimmer. These are great. So, I'm just going to go ahead and swatch these right here. Really, really pretty. I like to use these kind of as like an eyeshadow base. Um, they make shadow really nice. They are really nice by themselves, but it's such a pretty color. And then this dark gray one is in Glimpse. So pretty, so pigmented, and very, very like glimmery and just beautiful. And I do prefer like the cream shadow sticks over like, um, like, you know, kind of like with the doe foot applicator, like the actual cream. So this next palette is, um, you get 12 shadows and some glitters. The glitters aren't great. I mean, they're pretty, but you know, they're just the overlay over the gel, but the shadows, shadows are what's great. Um, a lot of mattes, very, very pigmented, very, very pretty. Let's go with this pretty green shade right here. Just really, really pretty. I mean, with a primer and everything, they're just gorgeous. And then this kind of camel color. Just really, really nice. I do enjoy these little shadows. And then this is their um, In the Shadows, five shades. Really, really cute design. You know, very pigmented once again. Um, really, really nice for like a smoky look. Plus I think like the little imprint is really pretty. Just really, really nice shades. Can't wait for fall. Uh, absolutely gorgeous. And then my last hard candy product that I absolutely love is the Hard Candy Sheer Envy Primer and it's shine free. Um, it's just a really, really nice bottle. You get 1.3 ounces. It's like six or seven dollars. And it's like a nice consistency. Um, 
it's not too thick, you know, it does feel a little bit silicone based, but um, it's not like the Baby Skin Primer by Maybelline. This is just a great, great primer. Um, I love to use it underneath all my foundations. I've never found a foundation that it does not work well under. Another great thing that is great about Hard Candy is that they don't test on animals. Um, so yeah, it's I really do enjoy these. So if you are looking for a different makeup brand to try, if you haven't tried Hard Candy yet, I would definitely give it a go. I definitely suggest their lip products. A lot of their shadows are great, and I, like I said, I absolutely love this primer. I love to put this underneath the Rimmel Stay Matte Foundation, and it really will keep you matte all day long. It's just a great primer. Plus, you know, it controls shine for a matte finish, um, prevents the oil buildup and reduces shine while reducing the need for foundation touch-ups. Lightweight primer is just for oily, sensitive, or problem-prone skin. Apply with fingertips onto the face. Um, it's great, great primer. I absolutely love it. Um, but yeah, it's already dry. It sinks in really, really quickly. It doesn't leave that um, silicone-y feel to the skin like the... Um, baby skin does so I really do love it a lot but anyway you guys that is my hard candy Monday must-haves I hope you enjoyed it if you did go ahead and give it a thumbs up um, go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you see my head floating around a little bubble click that and that's how you can subscribe go ahead and click that bell notification I upload every single day I don't want you to miss any videos you guys thank you so much for watching I really appreciate it you can follow me on my Instagram at Kman makeup and my Twitter and Facebook is at budget glam babe and I will see you guys tomorrow for another video. Have a great day guys. Bye.